Welcome back to the class on electrical vehicles and hybrid electrical vehicles. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about the EV configuration based on the drive train arrangements. Electric vehicle configuration based upon the drive train arrangement. Nearly six type of arrangements are using by the manufacturers and designers. Electric vehicle configuration with clutch, gearbox and differential. Electric vehicle configuration without clutch, gearbox and differential. Electric vehicle configuration with a fixed gear, motor and differential. Electric vehicle configuration by using a two motors. And electric vehicle configuration with in-wheel motor and mechanical gearing. Last one is a electrical vehicle configuration with in-wheel motor and no mechanical gearing. This is the first one is representing the electric vehicle configuration with a clutch, gearbox and a differential. So in this case, the front two wheels are connected by means of a differential and gearbox and clutch and motor. Whatever the mechanical output is given to the motor that is directly connected to the wheels through the differential. This is the clutch. By means of the clutch, we can make a connection and disconnection for the mechanical power which is passing from the motor to the wheels of a vehicle. Whatever the gear we are using here, it is a multi-gear system. When the driver is applying the gear to the vehicle with the help of clutch, next electric vehicle configuration with a without clutch and gearbox. In this case, the clutch is removed. The motor, gearbox and differential is there. The driver can apply the gear to the vehicle very directly. Whatever the gear we are using here, it is a fixed gear system. It is not a multiple gear system. So there is no need of using the clutch. Electric vehicle configuration with a fixed gearing, motor and differential. In this configuration, the motor fixed gearing and differential as a single unit that we are keeping on the frontal axis of a electric vehicle. The lot of space is available for the rear end of the electric vehicle. In this configuration, the differential also the remote because each front wheel is controlled by the motor along with a fixed gear system. So no need of using the differential in this con. Electric vehicle configuration with the in-wheel motor and mechanical gearing. In this case, the motor is placed inside of a wheel with a fixed gearing system so that we can eliminate the differential. So what are the motor we are keeping inside of a wheel that is nothing but a in-wheel arrangement of the electric vehicle. Electric vehicle configuration with the in-wheel motor with no mechanical gearing. In this case, the mechanical gearing also eliminated whatever the motor we are keeping that is keeping inside of a wheel. It is almost all equal to the in-wheel motor EV arrangement, but it does not have any mechanical gearing. In the in-wheel drive system can be achieved by low speed outer electric motor inside wheel dissipate abounding the use of any me mechanical gearing system along with the motor. So in this manner, different configurations of electric vehicles that is used by the manufacturers as well as the designers of the electric vehicle. If you have any doubt, <clears throat> thank you very much for watching this video.